Cell phone video captures a 12-year-old boy detained by Sacramento police, calling for mom. Moments later, as the 12-year-old is walked toward a squad car, video appears to show an officer wiping her face. The officers then put the 12-year-old on his stomach, handcuffed, while another officer takes out a spit mask and places it over his head. It's just every parent's nightmare. It's that spit mask that's become a focus of the 12-year-old's family. Latoya Downs is the 12-year-old's mother and says officer's treatment of her son was degrading. Degrading. He was, he was angry. He didn't know why it was on him. It was degrading at that point, and he was scared. He didn't know, he, he, he didn't know what to expect. What we do know is that the subject spit on the face of our officer. Sacramento Police Spokesperson Vance Chandler says the police department is reviewing how officers handled the arrest and that using a spit mask, this mesh netting material is standard operating policy. What about the fact that he was 12 years old? Does the age play a factor in determining whether or not um, that action is taken by an officer? Well, all that plays a factor, you know, all the, cir the circumstances that, that they faced during this incident, all of those play a factor. The incident comes as the Sacramento police overhaul force-related policies within the department following the Stephon Clark shooting. Attorney Mark T. Harris, who works for the Ben Crump law firm handling the Clark case, is representing the 12-year-old's family. I've never heard a situation where a 12-year-old child had a bag placed over his head. I don't care what they call it, a spit propulsion repulsing device. They can call it whatever they want. A bag is a bag is a bag. A family asking police to apologize. So far, the police department says their officers were simply following procedures.